Okay, welcome you viewers. Let's see what's happening. Remember that they, um, this is the third week of June of the Aries Sun Moon Horizon sign. Please remember that the full moon reading is up. Check out the full moon reading. These are wonderful. Let's see what's coming up for you, Aries, in this week. Okay. The end of a situation at work, death and transmutation, heartbreaks, the Empress. Okay, so we're having, um, we're having situations to deal with. Ooh. Mm. We're having situations where we're dealing with endings. I'm seeing the mother and the father coming up in your reading. So a lot of you are going to be having issues with mother and father. A lot of heartbreaks. Issues, mother and father, and heartbreaks is coming up. Um, you have two major arcana, three major arcana, four major arcana, five major arcana, and the nine of pentacles. Let's see what's happening for you here. It's um, there is um, an end to an issue at work, and you're turning your back. Okay. Um, so some of you Aries decide to turn your back on your work. Um, you're going to be looking for something new. Okay. Um, whatever the issue was, you decided, you know. I'm leaving. I'm seeing an issue with your parents. Whatever is transpiring, there's issue with your parents. Your father could pass away in this week. Mm, there's issue. There's definitely an organization. There's some issues with other people and organization. Yeah, you're definitely turning away from a father figure or a boss. You're definitely turning away from a father figure and a boss. Some of you, your your boss could think that you have done something, steal something, you Aries. There is this. Um, that's why you decide to turn your back. Some of you are turning your back. Your fathers are turning your back on you. That's in transition for the Aries. Um, you're trying to figure out an issue, but there is definitely something that is going on at work for you, Aries. Um, you're ending a conflict. It's as if you think, hmm, oh, I'm ending this conflict. This is um, unbelievable. Heartbreak is here. So you ladies, 45 years and older, are going to be heartbroken. Ladies, 45 years and older are going to be heartbroken. Whatever the issue is, um, you're going to be heartbroken. But then um, new love is going to be coming in. Okay, so ladies, 45 years and older, you're going to be heartbroken. But then new love is going to be coming in. It's as if you're heartbroken over a situation, but there are people that is going to be there for you. Nine of Pentacles keep on coming up in this week. So um, some of you are really going to be working towards making financial abundance in your life. And this is good. So um, definitely your financial stability is going to be very good in this week. The energy of the Empress, the Nurture and the Mother and Father energy is really coming up in this week. It is good for you to go and there is some judgment coming out. Um, some of you, your boss, think that you have stolen something. Twice the Empress. Twice the Empress. There is a lot that is going on um, with mother and father. A lot that is going on with mother and father. Just extremely a lot. 
there is so much that is going on with the energy of mother and father wheel of fortune okay so some of you whatever the issue is with your mother this is going to be resolved because your mother or your sister or a family member is going through some issue but a lot of you are dealing with organization um, and there are there are gossip this is not celebration there are gossip okay there is a difference between celebration and gossip they, 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 these are gossip so uh, wow mm, it's a weak you Aries Oof. Now there are some horrible people in the organization. There's a lot of jealousy. Um, uh, for some of you at work, there's a lot of jealousy. There are people that is um, um, standing. This is no celebration. This is just jealousy. There's just people that is standing and um, let's say you have no friends at work. Okay, so whoever you Aries is, you have absolutely no friends at work. I'm seeing you men walking away, turning your back on an issue, walking away, deciding that I need to end this issue. However, this issue comes up and play a role in your life is that you're saying, I need to end this. This need, I need to release myself of this there's definitely some information that is going to be coming out about some of you mothers if it's not your mother is your sister your sister-in-law um, your mother-in-law there is a sense of nurturing but whatever is this nurturing is about is about to come out there is an ending that is coming to an issue. Some of you, this could be an issue with an hospital. But at work, there is no friends. You have no friends on the work floor. Let's say that. Now, the Wheel of Fortune is here. And I'm liking this energy because it's bringing some good news. And with this good news, you're going to be um, having... Um, the the capability and the possibility to just move away to just um, to just move away and away from certain people certain energies um, because you have um, this situation where um, you are receiving what you need the financial support and and and, and you're going to be definitely moving away I'm seeing that some of you are definitely some real good positive news is coming up and this is like for the older people 45 years and older um, there there has been some heartbreak there could be a loss a loss where um, there could be a miscarriage some of you could find out that you have a miscarriage in this week there is a loss um, but there's a lot of love and support that is coming up so some of you maybe have to do surgery because I'm seeing the mothers coming up. The energies of the mothers are here. Um, and it is powerful. I'm seeing surgery. I'm seeing um, it's as if um, if you're in the hospital uh, unexpectedly, it's as if you stop breathing, but they um, you were resuscitated because this was that. It could be your mom, your grandmother, whatever it is is a double nurturing energy that is coming up for you and this is really positive definitely some of you are turning your backs on work you don't even need, want to deal with anyone um as, as if you know you're at the end and you're moving forward um the you men um some of you um managers could um, find out that someone who you have placed your trust in as um 
really um, created some illusionary around you that kept you in a position that you kept on forgiving this person, forgive them this person. And now it's as if you're removing yourself out of that energy. There's definitely a debt coming up in a family this week. Twice debt. Um, your crowning is debt. There's definitely debt that is coming up in a family. Um, it's not the throwing of the bridesmaid. It is um, the throwing of flowers on a grave. So there could be debt for some of you and there is funeral coming up. So twice debt. And if you notice, they're coupling up. So the debt could come um, from with parents, unexpected debt, mothers, um, unexpected debt of your mom. Maybe your mom just went into the, the hospital and yeah, sorry. Um, okay, but there is going to be debt. Twice debt in a reading and it has to do with mother. Twice the empress, the nurturing, mother, oma, grandmother, you know it. Okay, so be aware of that in this week that definitely a woman is going to be passing away and there is debt that is coming up. Now, I'm not liking this energy. Um, it's supposed to be a success, happiness and joy in an organization. Uh, the Aerophant and the Three of Cups. Aerophant and the Three of Cups. And I, I, I don't think you're celebrating really. Air fans in the three of cups. Yeah, you're trying to protect yourself. Yeah, I didn't get a celebrate energies. Um, I get an energy that you're trying to protect yourself. There is just um, jealousy. There's a lot of jealousy around you guys. So you have to be aware and careful. There is a lot of jealousy around you guys. And you're trying to protect yourself from um, issues that is going on. A lot of you, especially the men, are going to be turning their backs on issues, situation, it could be work and moving forward. Some of you are going to find out that your um, your partner have um, um, a child that um, your partner lost the child unexpectedly. Um, your partner is pregnant and lost the child unexpectedly. Um, there's going to be a lot of support coming in for this person. Now, Nine of Pentacles is here. Say thanks to the universe. Um, the universe have made it possible for this Nine of, nine of Pentacles. So, um, um, good um, financial stability is going to be coming in for you. Um, use it in a good manner, okay? So, let's see what else is coming out for you guys. We have card one and card two. And card one says, oh, celebrate life. Celebrate life. Yes, there's a debt. Whenever celebrate life come up, yes, there is a debt. So someone is going to be passing away. Um, definitely someone is going to be passing away. Celebrate life. I celebrate every day by honoring and uh, um, respecting all life of Mother Earth. Okay? All life of mother earth so a mother it could be not your mother but mother of a girlfriend um, this sort of energy is coming up definitely the death of a woman is coming in this week then all oh, the wheel of life yeah definitely a death double whammy the Empress uh, twice that yes it is that coming up in this week the wheel of life and it says I am um, I am guided by the cycle of life and life in complete harmony with them so it's all about celebrating life and it's all about new life okay so celebrating the end crossing over and it's all about new life that is coming in so this is really wonderful and positive so ladies and gentlemen I'm wishing you a wonderful week let me know how it went namaste